Welcome to USMLEFastTrack.com. The section we're going to talk about today is from First Aid for the USMLE Step 1, 2013 Edition. Page 556. What is Acute Respiratory Distress Syndrome? Acute Respiratory Distress Syndrome is a life-threatening lung condition that prevents enough oxygen from getting to the lungs and into the bloodstream. What are all the causes that can lead to Acute Respiratory Distress Syndrome? Acute respiratory distress syndrome can be caused by trauma, sepsis, shock, gastric aspiration, uremia, acute pancreatitis, or amniotic fluid embolism. Describe the pathogenesis of acute respiratory distress syndrome. In acute respiratory distress syndrome, one of the causes that we just mentioned is going to cause diffuse alveolar damage and increase in alveolar capillary permeability. Now, when there is an increase in the alveolar capillary permeability, there is going to be a leakage of protein-rich material along with neutrophilic substances into the alveoli. This protein-rich material is going to cause the formation of the intra-alveolar hyaline membrane, and the neutrophilic substance is going to cause damage to the alveolar wall. So basically, in acute respiratory distress syndrome, there is going to be high amounts of fluid that will end up getting into the alveoli and cause damage there. For more information on this topic, click on the link in the description section below. For a full USMLE Step 1 review, be sure to check us out at usmlefasttrack.com where we help you review the entire first aid for the USMLE Step 1 with high quality videos and hundreds of detailed pictures for a better understanding of the material. So to learn from the best USMLE review book, be sure to check us out at usmlefasttrack.com.